Manchester United captain scores a venomous half-volley in front of the Stretford end. Wayne Rooney will remember those kind of intros and headlines fondly. This time it was Antonio Valencia and the Reds' former captain and club's all-time top scorer must have feared his return to Old Trafford was going to be an embarrassing visit. But United inexplicably spared their admired teammate personal turmoil while he was on the pitch and saved their savage response and killed off the game only when Rooney was on Everton's bench. The Reds made us wait but the ruthless mode finally kicked in late in the day. It had been a typical after the Lord Mayor's show first half from Jose Mourinho's United. In fairness it would have had to have been a breathtaking display of monumental proportions for the Reds to have produced something that would have relegated Valencia's stunning fourth-minute half volley as top talking point. But nevertheless, when you have been handed a wow moment like the Ecuadorian strike against a side whose confidence tank is running on empty you'd have expected a reaction that should have destroyed Everton. Old Trafford was buzzing as the fans took in that wonder hit at the Stretford end and initially United looked like they might take Ronald Koeman's side apart. But the Reds appeared to sit back and think the job was done. After Mourinho's understandable post-match moan about his side showboating against Basel in midweek in the Champions League it was a surprising reaction. United have been in such destructive scoring form it wasn't asking too much to anticipate that Everton would be out of this by the interval. Instead the winded visitors were allowed to get the breath back and build a response that belied their early season form. With so many old boys on view in both sides you'd have expected someone to be a headline maker at some point. But it wasn't a great day for that band of players. He got it in the end. Romelu Lukaku celebrates his goal against old club Everton Wayne Rooney had the first real chance to turn the richly deserved pre-match applause for his old Trafford return in two years but slit his 21-minute chance just wide of David De Gea's right-hand post. Then former United Youth Cup winner Michael Keane had an aberration and gifted the ball to Juan Mata who sent Romelu Lukaku away five minutes later. The big lad is the man informed that he looked anything but against his former club. He studied himself perfectly but then poked a left foot effort wide with keeper Jordan Pickford at his mercy. It was not the finish the Belgian had probably been playing over and over in his mind on Saturday night as he drifted off to sleep. United had lost the swagger and Everton were in no mood to allow them to reconstruct it easily. The chances dried up for Mourinho's side save a crack against the post from Matter's free kick and David De Gea was infinitely the keeper asked to perform his duties most often. But as Rooney was putting on his tracksuit top on the visiting bench United decided it was time to put Everton out of the misery and a brief flash of their clinical best saw Henrik Mitaryu nail the second goal and then Lukaku got what Rooney didnt as he plundered a late goal against his old club and sub Anthony Marshall scored a stoppage time penalty. Three goals in less than ten minutes as Rooney looked. On. It was a burst that proved that United finally still had that show no mercy mentality. Get all the latest Manchester United news first with our new app. Download it here now.